I grew up here in Northern Virginia, in Alexandria. When I was just a, a small boy, I was walking down the street in my neighborhood one day, and I'm looking at, well, you know, the sidewalks and the street and, and, and the houses, and I'm thinking, who decides where all this goes? How, how close do you figure that you're putting the, you know, the houses from the, from the street, and just why do even exist in the first place? I studied city planning, and I got a, a master's in planning. Some of my earlier work had to do with uh, waterfront redevelopment uh, here in the metro area, also some of the, the new metro stops when they opened back in the 80s. You can see how you can help transform a place and, and change it in, in, into an even better environment that, that, than you started with. It, it, it really is a multi faceted endeavor and you know, how do you actually make these things happen and, and happen in a meaningful way that it's something that the community wants today what I do is redevelopment sometimes we're helping people fix up an older building and renovate it and uh, perhaps bring in a, a, a new company sometimes we're helping demolish older buildings whose time has come and work with the county to understand what kind of new buildings uh, what kind of new business or what kind of new community is sought on some of these properties and then uh, work with developers and property owners to put those projects together. You know, the, the beauty of, of redevelopment is you, we can have projects come to fruition where perhaps people didn't think could. Sometimes you have to look beyond what you're seeing right now to understand what could happen on, on some of these properties. So for instance, you could have a retailer that maybe uh, has left, and if you can attract you know, a, a, a trendy new retailer that can really add a whole different life to that shopping center and also to the nearby community, you're gonna see more vibrant places and the ability to attract perhaps our sons and daughters and their families back into the community as, as they grow up because it's a place where they, where they wanna live. It's just, not, it's just not an apartment, it's just not a, a, a house. When you get right down to it, you're creating better places for people to live and work. It's been helpful to be involved in, 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 in a profession where after a while, you can see the dots starting to connect, uh, not just changing a particular property or, or, or properties, but an entire area. So all these years later, I, I think that the kid in me, looking back at the at the street and the, uh, and the houses and wondering why they're the way they are. I think I'm, I'm still asking some of the same questions and I'm hopefully still finding some good ways to, to rethink a lot of this to make them even, even better places down the road.